Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. As you already know, this is your U.S. General. Five draw two card with side tray and deep compartment. Today is Friday, as you can see. We now back over at the storage unit, getting back to it, getting busy as always. All right. And today's video segment presentation, I do have a little slight tool haul for you. You know, something light, not nothing too crazy today, all right? But I ain't going to hold you up too much more longer in the introductory of things. But as I always state as usual, I always keep my signature lingering somewhere in the background. My Dunkin' Donuts coffee. You already know, okay? So pretty much about to get quite a few things out to the top of the tool cart and we're going to dive right in. So walk with me. Let's get it real quick. Just to give, you know, the viewers a little brief description of what's out there um, in this monthly flyer. All right. Take hold the unparalleled performance, precision and power. OK, you have your heavy duty combination slip joint pliers. You have a six inch combination slip joint pliers. Okay. You have a seven inch 90 angle jaw needle nose pliers. You have nine and a half 90 degrees bent needle nose pliers. You got your seven inch diagonal cutter, nine inch needle nose pliers, eight inch needle nose pliers. You have your six inch diagonal cutters and the nine inch stock duckbill pliers. So just to give you a little quick brief description of what's there. Okay, moving along down here, you have a few blue point products, which is a seven piece plier and cutter set by blue point. You have a 30 inch heavy duty bolt cutter just as well as a 10 piece miniature pliers and cut it set in blue point. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to move along into this little tool haul that I got for you today. Let's get it. Okay. First and foremost, want to thank my dealer. You know, I always love when individuals get on a truck and my dealer, um, sometimes may have to break up a set. So fortunately, you know, my dealer, he did bless me and throw me, you know, um, the organiza organizational foams for this particular set, which I actually do have all of these tools. I just basically um, needed the foaming just as well as I need the um, organizations for the sockets at the prior moment. I actually do have um, quite a few of these organizations when it comes to the new Snap-on foam trays. Um, I tend to have that layout in the new tool storage that I actually have coming within a few weeks because, you know, the accents are the same colors just as well, you know, in the U.S. General with my new box, all right? But until that time comes, you know, I will... Uh, get things laid out properly and give you a little nice tool haul and presentation of how I may have that particular box set out because I do um, actually have a lot of equipment. You know, when you take a look at the U.S. General, I have, you know, certain particular equipment in this particular cart, but there's only but, you know, slight few things that is coming out this cart such as, you know, some of the Snap-on products, the ratchets and things like that, which will go into the new tool storage, all right? But um, for this particular set, if it will focus in on the part number, okay, for this particular 3.8 set would be FMGSS08BR, all right? So, as you can see, the measurements and which are holes, which this is a standard SAE um, set. So you would see your standard measurements here, all right, which also enlists um, an extension. Then you have these miscellaneous voided spaces, you know, in order for you to store other particular tools such as bits or whatever, you know, that you tend to use or whatever the case might be. So I do appreciate this coming from my dealer. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to move along to the few things that I did pick up today. Let's get it. 
All right, first and foremost, I'd like to give a shout out to Easy Does It. All right, Easy Does It did remind me um, to pick up this item from a previous video that I put out in the past that I was actually on the truck. And fortunately, you know, my dealer only had one of them left. This is a four inch axle yoke right here. Um, the part number for this particular item is CJ123-2. All right, as you can see, this item is made in the USA, and this is a four inch axle yoke, okay, to push in the axles. So, this was a particular item that I did pick up, uh, fortunately, while I was on the truck just now. So, once again, shout out to Easy Does It. You already know, all right. So, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna move along. Let's get it. All right, the last previous time that I was on a truck, um, I did demonstrate and I showed uh, the new snap-on drilling hammer with the two flat sides. So I could have had picked it up the last previous time that I was on the truck, but I had quite a few things in hand and, you know, I just basically didn't want to carry it. So this particular time that I was on a truck, I did pick it up. Okay, so just to give you, you know, a little quick part number, which is SSD 32. This is a 32 ounce okay made in the usa so this is your double flat drilling hammer here all right so you know like i stated this week you know i slowed down a little bit because i do have quite a few other different things that is in a play and in a making at the prior moment, still waiting for my dealer, you know, to receive a few things. As you can tell, while I was on the truck, I was asking him, you know, when the next shipment and bogle deals and things like that will be coming in. Uh, what he was basically discussing with me is sometime in August, uh, what Snap On will be doing, will they will be basically pushing their extension sets and the bogles and things like that, which I am waiting for because I do need to replace a particular set, which is the 3 8 Wobble Plus sets, um, in which he does not necessarily have on the truck. I have them in quarter inch and I have a 3 8 set, but I lost um, three of the extensions, all right, out of the particular set. And I do actually have other snap-on extensions, but they're not Wobble um, Pluses. They're your regular standard uh, chrome extensions, all right? So, you know, that's just basically what that is. This is what was basically picked up on the day. Like I said, not nothing too crazy or anything like that, all right? So just once again, just to give you a part number on this particular drilling hammer here, which is HSSD 32. This is a 32 ounce. All right. And just to give you, you know, another little quick uh, part number of that four inch axle yoke real quick, which is, if I can get it to focus in, CJ123-2. Once again, this product is made in the USA. All right. So this is your four inch yoke, all right? And I guess for any of those individuals out there who is actually um, interested in the six piece set right here, which is a three eighth drive set, um, as you can see, it comes with three swivel um, sockets it comes with a ratchet and it uh, basically comes with extension. And once again, the part number is FMGSS08BR. All right, this is 3 8 drive. All right, once again, um, this end portion here is for miscellaneous. So this is why you would see the MISC for miscellaneous. All right, these are very nice foamings and these foamings are very, very expensive, okay, um, on a secondary market because Snap One does not necessarily provide um, these foam organizing trays at the prior moment, all right. All right, so we're going to end this video right about now. Today is Friday. The weekend is here. I want everybody to enjoy the rest of their weekend out there. Keep it a blessing, a safe one as always. And don't forget to tune in to the Heavy Wrench live stream just as well as CP the Two Addicts live stream. Uh, you have Justin Dow's live streams. You have Power Stroke Jude uh, live stream. You have West Main Auto's live stream just as well as Montevello Mustang. 
All right. So everyone keep it safe and blessed out there. And until the next one, we're going to check you later. Peace.